I think it's strange that a lot of men stop doing certain things as they get older, right? You get a little taste of success, you get a relationship, a little girlfriend, and you get complacent, you get comfortable, and you stop doing those things you used to do when you were hungry, when you had that fire in you, all right? And this is a no-no. One thing guys cannot stop doing is working out hitting that gym. You always got to take care of yourself. See what I'm saying? You should love going to the gym. As a man, that's the one place where you can take out your frustrations of the world, of your day, without being judged. Unless you play a contact sport or you're into mixed martial arts, the gym is a, a free place to take out your frustration, man. Take it out on your workout, your weights. And not only are you building a nice physique, but you are building mental strength, mental endurance. You boost your morale, you boost your spirit. And this is gonna keep you youthful. It keeps your blood flowing and everything functioning properly, fellas. I see this all the time. Guys get into relationships and next thing you know, you don't see them at the gym anymore. They start getting out of shape, overweight. And what you're doing, not only are you attacking your your morale your your confidence but you are allowing yourself to become unhealthy and that's what we can't do as men you got to be able to protect yourself and your family if it comes down to it but if you're not taking care of yourself how can you take care of your family this is how you got to think i love going to the gym man because it keeps me on my toes it keeps me sharp it keeps me uncomfortable it lets me know that I can always be better. I love feeling sore the next day because I feel like I'm doing something. It's going to keep you fresh. It's going to give you ideas and creativity. You would think something so small as working out for 30 to 45 minutes a day doesn't impact your life, but it does. Okay? You need to take a look in the mirror and ask yourself, how bad do you want to be great? How bad do you want to self-improve? How bad do you want to be the best version of yourself? Cause that's what it comes down to, that man in the mirror. Don't take shortcuts on your hygiene. As a man, you shall always find new ways to enhance yourself. This is why today's video is sponsored by T. Chinley. I've been using T. Chinley for a few years now and I've gotten a lot of results, all right? I think every man should have a skincare routine, a part of their daily habits. It's good for your confidence, it's good for your self-esteem and it's gonna help you find new ways to better improve yourself, all right? Three things I like about Tej. One, they give you everything that you need to be successful. You get a face wash, you get a face scrub, which is one of my personal favorites. You get an AM and PM moisturizer. The AM is going to keep you hydrated during the day and the PM repairs damaged skin at night. A second thing I like about Tej Henley is that it's very simple to use. Fellas, you don't have to be in the bathroom all day. They give you an instruction card that tells you how and when to use it. You apply it, follow the instructions, and you're good to go. Everything that you need is right there at your fingertips. Last but not least, what I like about T. Chinley is that it's affordable. It's not gonna drain your pockets. And because T's is sponsoring today's video, you get 40% off your first purchase and if you become a member of T. Shinley, you get 20% off for life, plus a free gift, all right? You get this nice silicone body scrubber, exfoliator, which I like, you know, it's something that I use every single day. So if you're interested, man, go ahead and click the link in my description and in my pinned comments and become a member of T. Shinley today. Another strange thing that men stop doing as they get older and this is crazy to me, is men stop loving. You stop being a loving person. And I know it's contrary to popular belief in this toxic culture today. It takes confidence to love. And a man should always walk in confidence. Hurt people hurt more people. You see people running around here shaming each other, putting each other down, looking down at one another, being hateful, being deceitful. Everybody who hurts people, they're just projecting how they feel about themselves. So 
that doesn't come from a place of confidence. It doesn't come from a place of love, of self-love. It comes from a place of, I hate myself. You see what I'm saying? Nothing wrong with love. Love is actually going to make you a better man because it takes a real alpha. It takes a real man to show love. Because if a man can show love, that says a lot about you. Your energy doesn't lie. The way you treat people shows the way you treat yourself. It shows the way you feel about yourself. So a man that can really show love, it shows that he loves himself. Okay, you're not doing it for anybody else. You're doing it for yourself. You're doing it because this is who you truly are. And this is truly how you feel about you. So a lot of you guys, man, you might have been a loving guy when you was younger. You got your heart broke. Your ex did you wrong or vice versa or whatever. But you don't trust women anymore. You develop a cold heart. I know we all go through a phase. You go through a phase of, you know, I'm, I'm never loving again. But you got to grow out of that. You can't take that with you as you get older. Okay, that, that's a sign of you haven't healed. That's a sign that you have insecurities. When you're truly being in your alpha male self, you are going to be a loving guy. I'm not saying be stupid. Don't be a pushover. But being able to show love is showing how truly alpha you are. All right, and don't forget that. Another strange thing that men stop doing as they get older is they stop reinventing themselves. We all go through changes. So no matter how bad you want to, no one stays the same forever. You gotta keep reinventing yourself every single day. You might be in a situation where you're having a flat line, which means that you don't have the energy or motivation, you're, you're bored because you're doing the same thing every single day. Well, that means it's time to switch it up. Switch it up. You might take the same route to work every single day. Take a new route. Allow yourself to see some new scenery. Okay, switch it up. You might eat the same thing every single day for months. Switch it up a little bit. You might go to the gym and do the same workout routine. Monday you do legs. You do the same exercises. Tuesday you do chest. Wednesday you're doing back. You know, switch it up a little bit. Your, your body, your spirit gets bored. It wants to try something new. Remember, we are here having a human experience. Okay, so you're not here to get comfortable and do the same thing every single day. If you feel like it's not working for you, this is a sign that it's time to switch it up. Okay, you have to keep reinventing yourself. Start dressing different. If you feel like you don't like the way you dress, your style is getting cramped up, switch it up a little bit. Switch your hairstyle up a little bit. Shave your beard a little bit different. Okay, don't be afraid to experiment with yourself, man. This is how you keep your life fresh. This is how you keep yourself motivated as well. Guys, let me know in the comment section, do you feel like a different man when you get a new haircut? Right? Something that small can change how you feel about yourself. It can change your whole confidence. Right? We all, we all been there. So that right there lets you know that just switching it up every now and then it can put you in a whole different energetic space. But you can't be afraid to change things up. For example, sometimes I might eat the same food every single day and then I'm like, man, my body don't, it's not hitting like it used to. My body doesn't accept this like it used to, right? I'm not seeing the gains that I want. That is your spirit speaking to you saying, man, look, I know you're trying your best I know we are disciplined and we're doing the right thing, but can we switch it up a little bit? Can we try something new? Just a little bit, just, just a little bit, right? I feel like as we get older, we get into a stage where we wanna be more content, you wanna settle down, and there's nothing wrong with that. But always remember, this life that we're living is not meant for you to be comfortable, no matter how bad you want it. This is why when you think you got life figured out, Boom, here comes something out of left field that's going to shake your whole life up. As soon as you feel like you got life all figured out, you're comfortable, you're laid back, something's always going to come to remind you that you are here to be uncomfortable. It happens every time. And this is letting you know that nothing stays the same forever. So you need to get on a program. You need to get in tune with nature. Nature switches up. The seasons change. 
everything changes. So you need to get with the program and do the same. Okay? Don't be afraid. Being uncomfortable is the best thing you can do because this is how you evolve. This is how you grow. If we never went through anything, if we did the same thing every single day, we would be stagnant. As a collective, we wouldn't have technology. We wouldn't have anything. Right? But the fact that we get uncomfortable, it makes us innovate. It makes us create new things. It makes us build wonders. So these are a few things that you shouldn't stop doing as you get older as a man. All right? Stay on your toes. Stay active. This is going to keep you youthful. This is going to help you to experience the best life possible. All right? So with that being said, I have a Retain Gang community. If you guys want to join, I'll leave my link in my description and in my pinned comments. We do weekly calls and discussions. I have some courses available. And it's cool to kick it with some like-minded souls. All right? If you need to speak with me one-on-one, -on -one, I do one-on-one -on -one consultations. I'll leave a link in my description and in my pinned comments. Don't forget to like and hit that subscribe button. Make sure you're subscribed to all the content, every post, so you don't miss a thing. With that being said, you have a beautiful day. And I'm out. Peace.